Uh, women, uh, you know, it's it's been a rough year for the women. Uh, they've worked hard, but uh, you know, we're still got some injuries, uh, still a little banged up. I mean, it's just it's one of those years. Um, we're gonna go. We're gonna take two or three over, and uh, you know, let them run and do what we can. Or look for individuals. Uh, so we're pretty excited about that. The girls worked really hard. It's just you know, it's it's one of those years where we're a small team. Uh, the depth's not there yet, so uh, we got to just go with what we got. And, and uh, Brittany Reese will run well. I know she will. Anjanae will run well. Uh, you know, they'll 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 put in the time and, and the effort, and we know they have. So we're anxious to see how they do. All right. And how about the men? Uh, men, we're going to be able to do a full team. Um, rested uh, Carson and, and and Raymond last week, uh, and the other guys ran. And they ran okay. Uh, we'd had a pretty tough week that week, so kind of getting ready for the region meet, and and uh, so they should all be recovered and ready to go. So we're we're uh, we're looking forward to that. Uh, you know, our goal on the men's side is to be top ten in the region, be top two or three in the conference. That's that's the goal. Uh, you know, for first year early back doing a full full cross country schedule, I'd be pretty happy with that. And it's a it's a stepping stone uh, for the women too. You know, it's not where we wanted to be, but it's still. It's a step in the right direction, so. Uh, we got a chance to be pretty good on um, both, both sides. Uh, women, we're not de depth-wise, but we're, we have a lot of quality. Uh, you know, it comes down to them doing the work over break, also making grades, doing all that fun stuff us coaches stress about. Uh, but as long as they do that, we'll be okay on the men's side. We've got a lot of depth. Uh, we've got a lot of talent back from last year's top five team. Uh, we've added a lot of talent as well. Uh, we've got some of the some of, some of our kids are some of the top kids in the country out of high school. Top 20 kids, top 30, 40 kids in the country. So they're uh, you know they're a bit pretty big time kids, and, and we're going to rely on them to to grow up fast. Uh, we're going to open up right now either at Texas Tech or Arkansas. Haven't decided yet. Uh, we're going to go throw them to the wolves. <laughs> And welcome to college track and field, and uh, kind of go from there. And, and uh, you know, we got a good group. We got a chance to to make some noise in the Jayhawk East, and and uh, make some noise in the Region Six, and then make some noise at the national level on both ends. So very excited about that. The coaches are doing a great job of, of training wise. Training's going great. Uh, several of our kids are, you know, the sophomores are getting recruited by the schools, and several of them been in to see us. And so, you know, it's in full swing already. So it's just. We won't open up till January.